When I come into your presence, I'm so happy. be broken because they have come into your presence let every affliction lose its power because they have come into your presence let every pain lose its venom almighty one in your presence, there is fullness of joy. In your presence, yokes are broken. In your presence, sicknesses and diseases are healed. In your presence, the powers of the enemies are made useless. In your presence, 
Amen. Find peace again. Amen. Let your presence, O oh Lord, overshadow us. Amen. Let your presence speak to us. Amen. Let your presence bless our lives. Amen. Let your presence strengthen our spirit. Amen. Let your presence encourage our hearts. Amen. Let your presence give us hope again. Amen. Thank you for your presence. When I come into your presence, I'm so happy. Jesus, when I come into your presence, and I'm so glad. There is anointing and the spirit moves around me. Oh, in your presence, anointing breaks the yoke. Father, thank you for this unsung presence. Help us to know the power of your presence and grant us the privilege to live in the power of your presence. When a man comes under the sun, he feels the rays and the heat of the sun. When a man comes under the rain, he's soaked by the touch of the rain. When a man comes under the wind, he feels the coolness of the breeze. Lord, we have come to your presence. Let us feel the power of your presence. Let us experience the touch of your presence. Amen. Let us know the awesome grace that flows from your presence. Amen. That our lives, Lord, will be blessed because we are in your presence. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. What do you want to bring to God's presence in this project? Prayer. I just want you to know that you are in the presence where the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings dwell. And I want you right now to just thank the Lord for this presence and tell Him, I am present, Lord, in your presence. Mark me present in your presence. I am here. I am just here. Everything about me is here. Even my worries are already here because I am here. My life is here. I am here, Lord, and I just wanted to know that I am here. I know you see me. I know you hear me, but I still want to say, Lord, I am here. I am here, Lord. Let your presence overshadow me. Moses said, Lord, if your presence will not go with us, don't take us further. If your presence will not lead us beyond this place, Lord, we don't want to go further because your presence is only the reason even our enemies will know that you are with us. Lord, this new month, let us know the privilege of your presence.
Grace my life with your presence, Lord. Grace my life with your mercy. Grace my life with your glory, Lord. And no one will terminate what you have for me. Grace my life with your presence, Lord. Grace my life with your mercy. Grace my life with your glory, Lord. And no one will terminate what you have for What you have for me, no one and no one we tell me what you have for me. In this new month, Lord, I'm asking you to grace us with your presence. Because no one, no power will terminate what you have for us. Fortify our lives. Fortify our lives. Fortify our lives. In the name of Jesus Christ. What do you bring to God's presence? Tell him. We are not like Jonas that runs from God's presence. No. We love God's presence. And Father, we want you to know that we love your presence. We are here in your presence. Tell the Lord what brings you here. Tell the Lord what brings you here. He knows how to settle the confusion in your heart. Yes, he does. He knows how to comfort a weary soul. Yes, he does. He knows how to strengthen the heart that is weak. He knows. He knows the battle you are going through. He wants you to be a hero in your determination. To keep walking with God, there is no going back. Bless the Lord because He cares for you. Bless Him, thank Him, honor Him.
praise this project prayer against every word men have said contrary to what God has said in your life. Men have said so much that you did not even hear about. Wicked hearts, evil minds, have pronounced things that you have not even heard of. Whatever you have probably heard is a mining of the deeper things they have said concerning your life. But I want to raise this project prayer today against every negative thing they have said about your life. Every evil thing they have pronounced over you, over your home, over your children. I am raising this project prayer against every, every negative, evil words that have been spoken, known, unknown, heard, or not heard, God's word against the words of men. This is the project prayer for you today. And I'm asking the eyes that sees what ordinary I cannot see, the ears that hear what ears do not hear, to address this matter for you. Father, this is our project today. When God spoke with Mary, the virgin mother of our Redeemer, He told her what men have said about Zachariah and Elizabeth.
seeing how pitiful people are go from one place to the other, seeking the help of demons to speak negative things into the lives of your children. They move from one strike to another, from one evil cause to another, from one coma to another coma. Lord, today, hear me. Hear me, Lord. Your children are not orphans. Your children are not precious. Your children are not rats. That the enemy, the evil ones, pretended friends think they can just say a thing just to mess their lives, just to cause them pain, just to cause them tears, just to make them suffer, and you hear their arrogance, and they beat their breasts. That unless they finish we take humor like them that they will not rest. And they make stupid balls that over their dead body. Will they let your children no peace? Ah, wow. If not the God. Let's raise our weapons. <laughs> 
And let's turn to our feet. I raise love this rosary against every evil pronouncement. Head or on head, spoken openly or in secret. Those who do not want to see your children succeed will fail. Yeah. Those who do not want to see your children leave will die. Yeah. Those who do not want to see your children happy, sadness will take over their lives. no man evil and we will do no evil to any let no man or woman do evil to your children yeah. whatever they have done in the yesterdays father may the grace of this welcome Neutralize what they have done. Whatever they have arranged into the future, let the grace of our weapon we pray today useless their works. Whatever they have done to happen in our todays. Let the power of your presence swallow them all. In the mighty name of Jesus. And the young man told me how they came to beg. Oh, we are sorry. We thought we would succeed. Yes, we took the life of your baby. We wanted to frustrate you so that your wife would do what we want and do the sacrifice we wanted. But everything is turning against us now. And once said, my children are not doing well because of the evil I've done to you, please forgive me they were saying to him. Father, I thank you because you fight for your children. And I raise this joyful mystery today because your joy shall return back to you. The joy that your enemies say they don't want to see in your life will return back to you. By the power of the presence of the Lord. Your joy will come back to you. Your joy will come back to you. I join the angel to announce in this first mystery of the Annunciation that joy will come back to you. Joy will return back to your children. Joy will come back to your home. Joy will stay in your home. Yeah. Whatever the sorrow and pain of the yesterday years, yesterdays, the joy that is coming will override that pain. Yeah. The joy that is coming will swallow up that sorrow. Yeah. And by the power of the living God, no man will terminate your joy again. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Our Father, Lord in heaven, our Lord, be your name, your King of God. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Help me.
very full of grace the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you are your women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Your Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruits of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruits of your womb, Jesus. Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother, pray for us sinners, and we are the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother, pray for us sinners. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now we are the Lord of God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, your Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, now and ever shall be, Lord of God, to the Lord. Precious Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire. Lead us to heaven, especially those of us to the believers. The second joyful mystery of visitation, let's go on our knees, if you can. And the man who had suffered from leprosy came to Jesus and went on his knees. He said, Lord, if you can, you can make me whole. Jesus looked at him. He said, I want to be home. And Mary came to Elizabeth's son. She opened the door and found Mary, she said. As soon as I heard your greeting, even the baby in my womb left for joy. <laughs> Lord, this is the power of your presence. That makes all things bow in the name of Jesus. Lord, whatever that has been attached negatively to 
the life of your children. Whatever they have used to cover their faces, whatever they have used to veil their destiny, whatever they have used to cover their lives. Have you seen where somebody is looking at somebody's CV application on the table and they cannot see who is looking at? Someone looking for your place to buy something, it will go around how many times? And is passing it, but he cannot see it. Someone will begin to see a different person in you, in your children. And he says, This is what I see about you. I see. A monster. I've not seen you. And all of these scares away good things. I raise this rosary that as God visits you and visits your children, that veil will lose its power.
The word of the Lord is against the works of man. Your light will shine. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Our Father, what in heaven, I will be your name, your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us, save us now on the earth of death, amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us, save us now on the earth of death, amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now on the hour of death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be war without end. Amen. Precious Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of hell, lead us to heaven, especially in this world of sin. I want you to make the sign of the cross on your forehead three times. Make the sign of the cross on your forehead three times. And by this mark of the cross, whatever that has been raised to cover you is removed in the name of Jesus. Yeah. The Lord has spoken in the Sabbath. And I raise this top mystery, the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ when he sits down. And I'm asking God every good thing that has been conceived shall see the light of day. The angel said to Mary, you will conceive. That's what she said. And it will bring forth. Muscle praying against every spirit of this courage that has tortured and tormented the lives of many. 
Mighty God, I speak your word into their life. That henceforth, the power that is causing that miscarriage lose your power over that body. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I tear asunder whatever they have raised to continually cause miscarriages. Be it medical problem, be it social or spiritual problem, I command you now, lose your power in the name of Jesus. And I speak into your life. You will conceive and you will bring forth that baby. You will conceive and you will bring forth that baby. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I pray for you that every good thing you have started, no power will terminate it. As Mary Despite the fact that doors were closed against them, no matter what the enemies are doing, what the Lord has laid upon your life shall come to light. May the power of darkness be broken. And may the power of light increase. You will conceive and you will bring to birth. May the Lord who speaks and does what is seen bring the good things of your life to reality. May the Lord protect every good that you do. That men will not use your good thing to fight you. They will not use the good you do to destroy you. You have business and you open your door to employ people whom the enemy want to use to pull you down, they will fail in the name of Jesus. If there be any of such wicked evil agents around you, may the power of God begin to drive them away from you. May them wake up one day and say, we can no longer remain here. In the name of Jesus Christ. So shall it be. So will it be. And so must it be. Your blessing will see the light of day. Your project will see the light of day. Your children will see the light of day. Amen. Our Father, what's in heaven, I will be your name. Your give up God. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Lead us not into temptation, but lead us Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you, young women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you, young women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, and now and the hour of death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus.
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. In the name of the Lord, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. In the name of the Lord, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it's not the rush of the Lord of our time. Precious Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of hell, lead us as to heaven, especially those who are most in the world of sin. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of the church is a sin temple. You are going to start to pray. And you are going to pray, Lord, that only what you have spoken that said will stand in the life. I, I, I want you to pray earnestly and to believe what you are about to pray. Look, the enemies have had a few enough. In this mystery, It was said to Simeon, you will not die until you set eyes on the Messiah of the Lord. Lord, the Lord says, and the hour that the Lord was to be presented, it happened that the Lord fell on him to be the minister in the sanctuary. You are here today, you are connected to this hour now. This is a spectacular grace God is delivering into your life. And I want you to speak to the Lord. He has said so much into your life. He has spoken into your life. And there are powers fighting what He has said into your life. Now you pray. The Lord only what you have said. I don't care what men have said. I don't care what they have spoken. I don't care where they have gone to, to say what they want to say. I don't care my name they have praised or used in their strife, in their corner to say stupid things. Lord, all I know and all I am saying in your presence right now is that only what you as you say this prayer, you are already nullifying whatever they have said. Whether you know it or not, whether you heard it or not, whether you dreamt it or not, whether you feel it or not, whether somebody told you or not, it doesn't matter. Whether it was said in your dream or it was said openly, it doesn't matter. Father, only what you have said in my life, only what you have spoken into me, only what you have decreed for me, only what you have established for me, Lord, this alone will stand upon my life. This alone will stand for me. This alone will work for me. This alone will go with me. This alone will accompany me. This alone will be with me. Only what you have said. Father, let it happen so. Let it happen so.
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of death. Amen. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, war without end. Amen. Precious Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of God. Lead us us to heaven, especially those of us to the Lord and us. The fifth mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Sometimes God walks in ways we don't know. But may he give us the patience to discover why he does what he does. I pray for patience for your life. Yeah. When God found Jonas and told Jonah to go and do some work for me, Jonah decided to go the opposite direction. <laughs> when people go in opposite direction, they can never meet. Never. Whatever the enemies have done to put you in opposite direction, either as husband and wife, as family, so that your ways do not agree, may the power of God prevail. Walked into the realm of the spirit in one of those days and they tied two images back to back. And why? May they not see for me. They're not with fear agree. Small things will cause their quarry. Waiting not make sense will cause their quarry. When Jonah ran away from God, going the opposite side direction, God struck the sheep or the sea with a mighty storm. And the word of God says, the men were throwing out of the sheep they were carrying, maybe they saved the sheep. But the more they were throwing those things out, the worse the threat against the sheep. <laughs> Have they found a man sleeping? Have they said, Are you not troubled by what is going on? You're sleeping. Tell us what you know. Jonah said, and they asked him, who are you? I, I, I love what happened. Jonah said, I am Hebrew, and I will worship God who made the heaven, the land, the sea. I am running away from God. 
He said, what? That's a bad thing to do. He said, throw me to the river. This is, this, this tomb will see. Whatever they have raised to cause confusion in your life, to cause confusion in your home, your marriage, your business, may the Lord rise and cast into the sea. May the Lord rise and cast into the sea. May the Lord rise. And you know what happened? As soon as it was thrown into the sea, everywhere became calm. And the men said, they vowed that they will worship the God of heaven. Stand to your feet. Holy
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Tell my children, even as they move about right now, that those who have raised you in the spirit world today is you. Physically, you're moving, but spiritually, they have made you start you. Stagnancy, backwardness. You can't move and make progress. The Lord says, Tell them. As you are moving about now, you have broken that chain. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of the womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. It was at the beginning of the and the Glory to God. Precious Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fire of hell. Lead our souls to heaven. Especially those who are lost in the love of your mercy. Hey, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, hey, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you the little boy, poor body and children of me. To you the little set of my sons. Lord, I will pray this body and tears. Tell them this gracious advocate. Your eyes of mercy towards us. And after this our head, show to us the blessing of the Lord Jesus. O Clement, O Lord, O Sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, Holy Mother of God.
shall it be. So will it be. And so must it be. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Yeah, those to bookmas, please do that quickly.